history of Ford Endeavor. In 2003, Ford Endeavor debuted in the Indian market. It was a large, long and boxy SUV which had a dominating road presence just like your regular American SUVs. Chunky bumpers, protruding body cladding and high ground clearance just meant pure SUV business. Launched at a price of Rs. 14 lakh, it was pricey at the time but was loved by many. The Endeavour got a torquey 2.5 litre diesel engine which seemed underpowered on paper but was a strong engine for its time. While rarely anyone took it off-roading, the Endeavour came with 4-wheel driver standard. Massive size, heaps of space, rough and tough and a strong engine were some of the highlights of the SUV. But just like that, it had its own shortcomings as well. The overall ride quality was uncomfortable and so were the seats which was one of its biggest issues. With a high price point for that time, it wasn't premium. Features like dual zone AC and vents for all three rows, all four power windows, CD player and cigarette lighter added to the convenience. But the cabin looked very basic for the price. Overall, it was a rugged SUV but it lacked reliability. The first generation Endeavour did receive a facelift finally in 2007 and was sold until 2010. Ford decided to retain the good bits and improve upon the bad. The new Ford Endeavour facelift got a new suspension which was more off-road friendly. It was a blessing to the rural and urban people with rough roads. Due to its large size and build quality, it was an instant hit among politicians and celebrities. Performance tuning enabled the facelift to produce 141 bhp and 330Nm of torque. Many new age interior features like music player and premium interiors were also part of the package. If you liked the video so far, consider subscribing. The second generation Ford Endeavour was launched in 2011 and was sold until 2015. This SUV again got an engine update. An all new 3 litre diesel engine was now available, which produced 151 bhp and 380Nm of torque. The car designers also kept up with the times and included modern exterior features like body colored bumpers, alloy wheels, and overall better quality products. The interiors also received a better fit and finish during this generation. This was the first Ford Endeavour to come with a touchscreen infotainment system. You also got a rear parking camera and Bluetooth connectivity, which was all the buzz at the time. The Ford Endeavour always stood ahead of the Toyota Fortuner in terms of overall features. It was a finished and polished product unlike its raw competitors. This was also the first Endeavour to get automatic transmission as well. The last generation Ford Endeavour was launched in 2016. This generation also recently received a BS6 update. Before the BS6 update in India, both 2.2 litre and 3 litre engines were present. But after the BS6 upgrade, Ford provides the Endeavour only with a 2 litre engine. Ford Endeavour went from being the SUV with the largest engine to the SUV with the smallest engine. While performance and fuel efficiency are adequate, premium SUV customers always like bigger engines in their cars. The new off-road system and drive modes enable easy and comfortable off-roading. The new sport variant of the Ford Endeavour was also recently launched with a 10-speed automatic gearbox. All the modern features and amenities have been provided with the car. Over the years, Ford Endeavour has also gained popularity and trust just like its arch-rival, the Toyota Fortuner. Ford announced its decision to exit the manufacturing of vehicles in India in September 2021. There were several factors that contributed to this decision. Competitive market The Indian automotive market is highly competitive with strong competition from both domestic and international manufacturers. Ford faced challenges in terms of market share and struggled to achieve significant sales volumes compared to its competitors. Despite efforts to introduce new models and updates, Ford's market position remained relatively weak. Financial losses Ford's operations in India incurred significant financial losses over the years. The company faced challenges in achieving profitability and cost efficiency due to various factors including lower sales volumes, high production costs, and inadequate capacity utilization. Operating challenges Ford faced operational challenges in India including high taxes and duties on imported parts which affected the overall cost structure. Additionally, the lack of economies of scale due to lower sales volumes limited the company's ability to reduce costs and improve profitability. Changing focus Ford decided to shift its focus and resources towards markets where it could achieve better profitability and growth. The company's global strategy involves investing in electrical vehicles, autonomous driving technology, and connected mobility solutions. The decision to exit India was part of Ford's broader restructuring efforts to prioritize and allocate resources to key market and technologies. Ford maintains its parts distribution network 
to serve existing customers and support the service and maintenance of its vehicles in India.